Welcome back, everybody, to whatever this game is. Seven, <laughs> seven days without Alpha Experimental. I, my brain just decided to take a nap there for a second. Uh, yeah, on Alpha 21 Experimental, I'm an old guy. Gaming to end in this episode. We're going to go out and do our very first Tier 4 Infestation. We're starting with an Infestation. Not even a normal Tier 4. So, yeah, we'll see how this goes. I uh, <laughs> don't know how well it's going to go, but we're going to give it... The good old college try and see how things go. Hope you guys are all having a great day. Had a pretty good day today. It's, uh, the work day is finally over, and uh, so spend a little bit of time here in the early evening recording another episode of this awesome game. So I'm a little concerned, <clears throat> not going to lie, about this place because we got ourselves into trouble here once before when we were... Um, you know, when we were just doing some random looting. Um, I don't know if it was this exact POI. Let's see, has anything been looted in here? It might have been a different way station. Yeah, see, that's empty. That's locked. We should, uh, let's see if we can lockpick this. Might as well. So we're going to have to use some strategy here <laughs> uh, to, to survive this. Because if we just go in... And try and take this head on. We are not going to make it. So that will probably consist of maybe uh, retreating to the roof if we have to. Uh, I don't know if they can get on the roof though. So we'll have to see how that goes. Let's see what we get here. Uh, that's pretty nice loot actually. I'll take it. I'll take it. <clears throat> okay, so... Um, I want to see something here. Let's here. Let's get rid of this. Okay, I don't see a way over here that they could get up here. <clears throat> hey, there's a bag up there. So yeah, there there isn't an apparent way that they can get up here. So I think what we'll do is we will use the roof as a place for us to retreat to um, if and when things get a little too hot and heavy. So I think we can make that work. Oh, nice, nice jump there, OG. Yeah, that was just stellar. Um, so maybe what we'll do is... How strong is this? That's only a 1,000 hit points. They could take down this carport pretty easily. So I think we better use the building itself. Um, and so what we'll do is we'll start the quest. Uh, but then I'm going to probably make some ladders that we can use to just quickly jump up there. Um, here, let's cancel those. Uh, I'm just about out of steel arrows, so I started making um, iron arrows again until we can come across some more steel arrows. Whew, okay, <laughs> this is crazy. Actually, hold on. Before we, before we actually start, um, <clears throat> thing thing is, those probably. Some of the Zeeks that were back here. Yeah, I'm not. Oh, wow. That goes way down there. Oh, shit. That was fun. <clears throat> and keep in mind, that's not normal, too. Um, I'm not going to go double loot the main loot, because I just don't do that. I, I think that's cheating. 
If you don't think it's cheating, that's absolutely fine with me. Play the game the way you want and enjoy it and love it. Me, I don't double loot the main loot. It's just me. Okay, so... Oh boy, here we go. <laughs> Tier 4 infestation. What am I doing? Oh, this is crazy. Absolutely crazy. Okay, so the first order of business is we need to see if we can get up on the roof with these ladders without aggroing all the freaking zombies around here. Uh, I have a red dot over there somewhere, but I don't know. Oh, it's a Nurse Nancy. Okay. Ooh, look at that landmine. Feral Nurse Nancy. Let's see if we can get her to run over the landmine, because why not? Nope. All right, now I heard Koparuski wake up over there. Fortunately, he's a normal cop and not a feral, so we don't have to worry too much about him. Okay, somebody else is coming. Another police officer, but again, just a normal. Can handle that. Okay. Now, let's go ahead and grab these. And we're going to put them right there. And get this stuff out of the way. Okay, let's make sure there's no buzzards up here. Doesn't look like there are, so I think we'll be okay in that regard. That thing's going to explode when we get within proximity. Let's go scrap this again. Nice. Okay, so we're not going to spend the entire time up here, but it, it's just a, a place we can retreat to as needed. All right, let's do the cop car again. Right on, got it on the first try. Beautiful thing. That's an actual upgrade for our hunting knife. That is really good stuff. Okay, so let's take and put these on here. Nope. On here. That'll make us quieter. I think... But yeah, we already have one of those on the bow, so we'll hang on to that for selling later. And our knife, let's modify this. And that's, that's not really worth burning a repair kit, I don't think. So... Let's get this a little closer. Okay, now I want to make a drop chest here. Okay, we really need to keep an eye on the the durability of this AK. Um, I've got I've got uh, repair kits, but we'll wait till it gets down a little bit more. All right, so we dealt with him. He's he spit on this car, made me a little nervous there. Okay, we got a feral uh, business guy. See if we can. Did we put him down? Yeah, we put him down. Nice. Okay, we'll check the car.
take those two things. All right, let's um, let's do the this next. Then we'll then we'll do the interior before we go into the backyard because we kind of know what's going to happen when we get to the backyard. Oh shit! You radiated Arlene. Let's um, let's take one of these and see if we can get Egger to come over here so we can poke him. No, don't be doing the crawling business. Uh, no. Not interested. I'll probably harvest all of these corpses later just for the for the stuff. Okay, so that takes care of the front. Now, let's go back into here and see what might await us. Got some books, machine or assault rifles and forges. Forge ahead it. For, forge ahead is forge aheads. All right. Water. Vehicles. It's cool. Little uh, CB radio there. That door's locked. All right. So that's all we can do in here, I guess. Let's go into here next. Coffee. That door's locked too. Okay. Restroom. With some toilet paper. Oh shit. Uh, no. That door's locked as well. Search the lockers. Nah. And the books. All right, we'll, um, we'll learn that. Even though I already have one. That's okay. The door's locked too. Okay, so they do not want us to go into the backyard via the doors. So they do want us to come around here. There's um a little uh, t triage tent thingy here. Woke up three Zeeks, including a greenie and two construction workers. We should be able to handle them. But let's pull them away from the rest of the the group there. All right, they're kind of derping out on the vehicle there. In fact, they for, they forgot about us. Okay, he's dead. We can generally kill Arlene fast enough to not have to shoot her with the um, shotgun because I don't want to wake up the whole rest of the gang if we don't have to. Nice. Look what we found, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful. Okay. 
That is a good upgrade. Let's um take the mods off of here. Uh, let's see. Oh, right here. So now I'm glad I didn't make that level one steel because I'm pretty willing to bet that a level six purple iron is probably better than a level one steel. It might not be, but more than likely it probably is. This will put some mods on and sell it and make a pretty decent chunk of change when the time comes. All right, we're checking this and that. All right, let's check in here. Got a medical pile. Okay, and I think that's... Now we got some clothing. Yeah, we'll take those. Yes, indeedy. Okay, so um, I'm trying to decide how I want to play this next. We know that if we get somewhere right around the front of that semi, that thing's going to explode and wake everybody else up. Let's see. Okay, so we were able to loot this car. We'll open this guy up. You know what, though? I don't see any flames coming out of that tanker like before. Hmm. There's supposed to be flames coming out that thing. All right. We are six units in cupboard. So let's run back to our drop chest and lighten up a little bit because we're going we're gonna to probably have to run here pretty soon. I'm going to pop a sham chowder. We need some health and we need some food. And let's also throw back a mineral water. All right. Now, let's see if we can loot or pull some Zeeks out of this building without waking everybody else up. Gonna loot the oil because we have we have plenty of oil. I don't even see any zombies at the moment. Duffel bag. Um, we'll take that. Luggage. I guess we we did have some cloth in our drop chest, so we'll scrap that. Okay, red dots just appeared. I have three red dots. One of those, maybe even two. Oh, there's the flame. Okay. We know at least one of those will be a dog and possibly two, based upon our experience from last time. And I see an Arlene. I don't know if she's irradiated inside here now. Let's see what happens if... You know what? We better repair this, and we better repair this. Yeah, she's green. Nice. Dispatched her without waking up anybody else. So probably in that red tent is where the dogs are. And if they are, then there's no way we're going to be able to shoot them from here. I'm just looking. That thing's going to blow. Maybe it isn't. 
Let's loot this. That, that, and that. Okay. Get a little nervous now. Hmm. I don't reckon there's any. Oh shit! I was gonna say, I don't reckon there's any chance we could get to the fat loots. All right, what do we have to deal with here? That's kind of worked out pretty good. Have these guys run in here. Can't really get to their head very well. Nobody's coming around that corner. That's a lot of zombos. All right, well, we killed a decent amount of them, but not all of them. I see two red dots left. And a dog. Oh, shit. We did it. <laughs> All right. That wasn't, uh, that wasn't absolutely terrifying. It was just mostly terrifying. Oh, yay. Yay, yes. Okay, we'll scrap that. Let's go see what's in the fat loots. I wonder if there's anything interesting down there. Man, I'm glad this stuff doesn't blow up. All right, weapons bag. Nice. Meds. Ammo. Passing gas crate. And that's uh, harvesting tools. Steel tools quality two. Very nice. Um, so that means we can now make a level two steel pickaxe, but I don't have the problem with that though, is I don't have the, um, the actual parts. I have one steel tool part that we can use for cooking. All right. So we don't have any room left in our inventory. So let me go back this way and drop a few things off. Duke Collector. We got some plastic out of there. Can we poke through this? Doesn't look like it. Can we shoot through it? Yes, we can shoot through it. All right, let's look in here. I doubt there's anything behind there, but we'll check anyway. Okay, uh, here's a duffel bag with some glue. We'll take glue. We like glue. Glue's good. All right, let's grab this wood. And now let's check this first since we don't have to unlock it. Look at all that stuff. Oh, nice. We got some new steel arrowheads, too. That's going to come in handy. Man, I like that loot. That's why we're doing the infested, ladies and gentlemen. All right, let's pick, uh, pick this lock. It 
This wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. But, you know, we used some smart tactics too this time instead of just, just you know, going in like a bull in a china shop. That would not have gone well for us. Ooh, these are nice. Semi-mod. Yeah, I like that. We'll learn that. We'll learn this. That is probably not worth anything, so we're going to scrap it. And then let's go to here. I love it. I love it. This was a good run. Very good run. Okay, so before we leave, I do want to harvest uh, all the corpses. And I'm kind of curious about what's going on down here. That door's locked. There's water in here. That breaks easy, but there's nothing inside of it. Here we go. Um, we're already we're already wearing the college jacket, and we got an upgraded chess piece. Fantastic. Uh, but we'll have to take care of that later. Uh, we could pull out, but let's just see. Oh, never mind. We can come out this way. What's going on in here? Is there a vent on this side? Hmm. I don't know. The game doesn't normally have you break blocks to get into places in this, uh, unless it's a, you know a real quick and easy block to break. So not sure what's going on with that. All right, so I am really only interested in rotten meat. I don't care about the bones or the nitrate. And we do have one slot left. Let's see what's in here. Nope, don't care about that. Uh, oop, I care about those. All right, I guess it's time for us to go back and empty the chest again. So here's what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to go around and and just loot. Oh, for goodness sakes. Here, let's throw that out. Uh, just loot the rest of the the stuff, you know, the basic stuff here. And then I'll meet you guys. What time is it? Oh, we got to hurry. Yeah, I'll meet you guys back at Jen's for our turning. Hey, Jen. Well, aren't you a sight for sore eyes? I am a sight for sore eyes. How can I get you? Okay, so we need to drop something momentarily so we can get the reward. And we'll drop the spring. Now that you have some money to spend, we're running a 10% off sale Ooh, for the rest of the day. That is nice. We're taking the steel boots. Okay, and then I want to sell this to her and that to her. That needs to be repaired. Now Here, that was that a good deal. Back up. Trust me. Trust I'm a me. Doctor. You're a doctor. I know you are. Um, okay, I think that's all the rest I want to sell to her. Yeah, wow, look at that. Super nice upgrade. That's some darn good loot, you guys. And uh something like this, you know, we can we can sell, but I need to fix it up first. And put a mod on it if, if possible. Same here. Okay, cool. So um you reset on 34, uh, nothing so nothing this time. We have checked your inventory at this point, so let's uh, see what jobs you got. Okay, you have another infested clear, tier four. You looking to earn some dukes? The Helene's residence. Like Let's you. do it. Hurry back soon, and I'll have a nice reward for you. Yeah, if it's like the last one you gave us, that was a nice reward. All right, fantastic, guys. This has been a great episode. We got some nice upgrades. We got level six steel boots, level six iron pickaxe, level six uh, chest piece, uh, scrap armor chest piece, and some other good stuff too. But those are, I think, those were the the really good prizes. So very happy about that. All right, guys, I'm gonna let you go here. I'll probably um, just do some work around the house uh, tonight. Probably keep working out in the yard here and stuff, and getting stuff cleaned up. And then uh, tomorrow, we'll start the next episode and we'll go do our second 
ever tier four infested quest and hopefully we'll get some more really good fat loots so thanks everybody for watching hope you enjoyed this episode and if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel leave a comment and share out the video and we'll catch you in the next episode bye bye Thank mm -hmm. you.